we got ourselves a Megaton around 50. Once again, a non pack punched M1911. Are we going to be able to one shot this? Keep in mind, this is still red tier. This is the same pistol I spawned in with. Haven't done anything except slap on dead wire, which keep in mind costs 2,000. 500 points let's see so what do you guys think is this gonna you know one shot this all we gotta do is get a zombie near it let's shoot the zombie with dead wire all right there we go and it's sweet it's one of the red panzers i want to activate dead wire on this i want to see what we can do with it it might be a little bit harder uh but as you can see obviously this gun's not doing much of anything to it but if we can activate dead wire near it how much damage is it gonna do oh my god it took it down it's already moving one shot this video once again is gonna be on dead wire because there's something we didn't really test in our last video and it is actually quite insane on how all of this works so as you know when they release season two reloaded they try to kind of nerf dead wire however with that they kind of made it so it spread to less enemies which we showcased in our video yesterday however with this if you use this against elite enemies like megatons panzers and all of that stuff it actually does a crazy insane amount of damage so using this on d machine and outbreak you are able to just annihilate bosses we're going to go through give you a ton of examples we're going to go to around 50 on d machine show you how quickly we are able to destroy a megaton on that and then we're going to show you some panzer damage it is actually quite insane and honestly after doing all the testing i've done to this point this was definitely a buff deadwire definitely got better going from season two to season two reloaded it does kill less zombies so if you're training up zombies killing them it's not going to kill as many zombies especially if you're not training up zombies when you're shooting into zombies as they're flowing in it's not going to kill as many zombies as it used to however this ability is going to demolish bosses it is actually insane but with all that being said let's go in game so i can actually show you what i'm talking about here all right so now we're in d machine and yes i'm using the m1911 we're gonna see if i can kill a megaton with one bullet with an unpack a punched m1911 on round 50 but obviously to do that i gotta do a real quick grind to round 50 so let me go do that while i'm doing that if you guys want to sub we're getting really really close to hitting our goal of 50k sub greatly appreciate anyone who's joined us on this journey and once again i just want to show my appreciation to everyone who's left a like and comment on this video you guys are freaking insane and it's part of the reason these videos are taking off boys but given that look at the variant on this m1911 that gold looks really well with the dm ultra i don't know why i just i think this variant looks pretty clean all right but enough of that let me go grind so we get a megaton all right boys it's round 10 let's go ahead slap dead wire on this and let's see if we can you know kill this megaton in one single shot so we got dead wire on it now the thing is just like dead wire used to work you got to shoot a zombie next to it and if we do that oh my god we just already split the megaton one shot you know round 10 no big deal oh what about the um the smaller forms though what if we get you know a zombie in between them and let's try to you know shoot one of the oh shoot one of these zombies and now the same thing it should work for the uh split forms of it too so if we have dead wire again and uh i'd like to get both of them together i don't think it's gonna happen but what if we activate dead wire right here and split form dead nice oh did it get the other one too no way yep that one bullet killed uh the split form both of them in one shot there so yeah obviously round 10 that's not too impressive uh but let's see what happens when we take this to a higher and higher round are we gonna continuously on any round we want be able to one shot the megatons that is just ridiculous man and even though dead wire doesn't kill as much as you can see still killing tons of them but if you can just you know one shot a megaton on any round yeah this might be uh, a little bit broken to be honest all right guys so you know the drill just a real quick grind to 54 you know i'm gonna stop grinding to like round 50 and higher on these uh videos because i'm grinding around 50 every day in this game i'm gonna go insane but there we go we got ourselves a megaton around 50 once again a non-pack a punched m1911 are we going to be able to one shot this keep in mind this is still red tier this is the same pistol i spawned in with haven't done anything except slap on dead wire which keep in mind costs 2500 points let's see so what do you guys think is this gonna you know one shot this all we gotta do is get a zombie near it let's shoot the zombie with dead wire and did we get him Oh, would you look at that? An unpack a punched M1911 round 50 just completely annihilated that Megaton in one shot. All we had to do was shoot a zombie near it. So let's do the same thing. Uh, let's finish off the baby forms of it as well. If we can go down without killing ourselves and let's shoot a zombie near it again. Oh, it activated Shatter Blast. Unfortunately, not what we're looking for. Just as a comparison there though, as you saw, we activated Shatter Blast and look at how much damage it did to the, you know, Megatons being shot near it. But let's try to activate 
dead wire again if we can get it ready to go again and we went down nice all right so you know we got our perks back because i did go down there because we're screwing around trying to shoot a zombie next to the megatons to prove a point here but once again let's get another zombie near the uh, baby forms here and let's shoot one single bullet and it's gone did we get both of them no we only got one the other guy wasn't close enough but all we got to do is wait you know enough time for it to recharge real quick and we'll take down this megaton as well and one single m1911 bullet oh there we go already charged again and there you go one shot for each version of the megaton the big one took one shot and each split only took one single shot all we got to do was shoot a single shot and it destroyed it so yeah uh deadwire is actually more op now if you're playing uh d machine and you don't like megatons all you got to do is slap deadwire on any weapon and whatever round it is, you'll be able to take out a Megaton in one bullet by just shooting a zombie right freaking next to it. But yeah, we're not going to stop here. I'm now going to go and Outbreak. Go to round seven when you get the health cap on Outbreak. And we're going to see exactly what Deadwire does to Panzers and the boss forms of Megatons on Outbreak. However, to do that, I'm going to have to go on Outbreak. We're going to have to get set up and we're going to have to repeat this process again. So this is, this is going to be a long time in the making of this video, boys. This one's So yeah, let me go ahead do that and i'll be back with you guys again oh all right finally we got an eliminate the high value target i've been trying to get this took us all the way to wave five let's see what we get i want to see how much damage we're able to do to one of these on outbreak so let's go ahead see where this thing's gonna take us if it can go ahead and spawn in all right i guess we're just gonna cut then because it hasn't spawned in yet that's your cue that's your cue you're gonna spawn in Okay, maybe not. All right, well, I'll be back. All right, there we go. And it's sweet. It's one of the red panzers. I want to activate Deadwire on this. I want to see what we can do with it. It might be a little bit harder, uh, but as you can see, obviously this gun's not doing much of anything to it, but if we can activate Deadwire near it, how much damage is it going to do? Oh my God, it took it down. It's already moving one shot. You can one shot the freaking eliminate bosses in Outbreak. That is ridiculous. Now we just, you know what? 15 seconds. It's going to be charged and ready to go again. Guess what we're going to have to do? Let's just get a zombie near it, boys. Yeah, uh, I safe to say that Deadwire is uh, still OP and it honestly might. Oh, guess what? And it's dead again. Just like that. Are you kidding me? All right, boys, let's go to its final thing. Keep in mind, this is wave five. It's still not at health cap, but I mean, we're pretty freaking close to it. These are unpack a punched burst pistols that all they have on them is dead wire. Look, not packed at all. If we were to shoot, shoot it, look at how little damage we're going to do. We're going to, it's not even going to dent it if we shoot it normally. Yeah, it's doing 46 damage, but hold on. All we got to do, get him right near a zombie again. Come on, get right next to it. Land near the zombie because dead wire is already charged again. Let's activate it again. Maybe there we go. And it's gone. Three bullets killed the entire thing. Just like that. Wave five. No issues. Uh, so yeah, I think it's safe to say that even though, yes, they did try to nerf Deadwire, and in some aspects, it is worse. You're right. If you're killing zombies, it is not going to go to as many zombies as it was before, and you're not going to kill an entire horde anymore, and you're not going to kill as many zombies when you're using it to attack, but uh, they did make Deadwire an absolute monster for destroying bosses. This is definitely the single best ammo mod in the game. We just took down an eliminate target panzer with three bullets and each time it did the maximum amount of damage that it would allow it to do. So in my opinion, if you had to ask me what the single best, most powerful ammo mod is, I'd have to go with Deadwire. Deadwire is still one of the single best ammo mods for, you know, in general, just killing like mass amounts of zombies at once. Yes, it doesn't kill as many as it does before, but uh, it can also make a weapon usable on any round. We could take these Damati pistols, we could take it on round 100, and it would still insta-kill any zombie if you use dead wire on it and on top of that now with this new update it absolutely demolishes any sort of boss all you've got to do is shoot a zombie near the boss with the dead wire effect and boom the boss is dead boss is dead and that just like that you've just killed the boss so uh yeah uh i can safely say that um it wasn't really a nerf it was more of a buff i i would rather have dead wire in its current state right now than I would pre-patch Deadwire. Because any day of the week, I would way rather have Deadwire, you know, take out a boss in one hit than I would be able to kill a few extra zombies. So yeah, that is the final verdict on Deadwire, boys. It's uh, it's crazy OP. So yeah, definitely go use this before Treyarch realizes quite what they've done and revert this, because this will not stay like this for long. This might be like this for a month, but I definitely have a feeling that Deadwire is gonna get reworked again because uh, it is, it's a monster. It's even more of a monster now 
than it was before, boys. Yeah, but I, I'm, I'm gonna leave this one here. If you guys made it all the way to this video, comment Deadwire lives on in the comments because Deadwire is back stronger than ever before, boys. Peace.